here we have the Arroyo Verde Choir with a special performance. Hold on to me as we go. As we roll down this unfamiliar road. And I'll go this way, we string us along. Just know you're not alone. Cause I'm gonna make this place your home. So down, it'll all be clear. Don't pay no mind to the demons, they fill you with fear. The trouble, they might drag you down. If you get lost, you can always be found. Just know you're not alone. Cause I'm gonna make this place your home. Settle down and it'll all be clear. Don't pay no mind to the demons, they fill you with fear. The trouble it might drag you down. If you get lost, you can always be found. Just know you're not alone. Cause I'm gonna make this place your home week I want to challenge you to take a mindful minute every day outside. To do this you go outside and you sit. You close your eyes for one whole minute and focus on all of the sounds that you hear. After that minute passes ask yourself what did you hear and how do you feel in this moment? Make sure you go outside for this mindful minute because being outdoors can give you a more positive mood and it can help your brain focus and be creative too. Hi everybody, here I am in my Zoom room. I just wanted to say that it's been a crazy year. I mean, we, we went off on spring break and before we knew it, we were told we can't come back to school. Um, everybody experienced a huge mixture of emotion, but the teacher parade, that was the best. It was, it was a little bit of closure for me. We made the whole community happy and that was probably the best feeling um, since all of this started. So our classroom was always your home. And I hope you do come back and see me because I'm going to miss you a lot. <sighs> Promise no crying. But this is not to say goodbye, but yet to say see you later. So go off and be the great person that you are. Each and every one of you has something to offer this big crazy world. You made it to sixth grade. Congratulations. Come on, let's go down. Oh, hi, my amazing students. You actually just caught me celebrating singing in my best Beyonce voice. Over the course of the time we had in the classroom, we got to have amazing adventures together, like sailing the high seas on a pirate ship to learn 
arithmetic? Or how about diving for ancient artifacts? You're going to miss my corny jokes. We also got to walk into Pereira Memorial Hospital where you got to be the doctors to dissect text features. And I was your nurse. And if I may say so myself, you were pretty bossy doctors. We have learned so much over the course of our journey. And I must say that this is a class I will never forget. And this is a fifth grade year you will never forget. We have learned to persevere. We have learned resilience that we can tackle anything that comes our way. If there is anything that you take from these times of uncertainty and the question mark that was above our head of what's happening next, you, my friends, have accomplished big things. You are living history. This is a time that we will never forget. Ladies and gentlemen, you are the reason I come to work every day to see those faces light up and to watch you grow socially and academically has made my teacher heart happy. Although you may not feel ready, you are ready. Class of 2031, you've done it. You've made it. You're headed to the sixth grade. So what do you do now? You celebrate.